Hello everyone, this is the Hero of the Wind. It's been a long time since the last time you heard my voice, I know, or maybe it's even the first time you hear my voice. Uh, this is obviously unscripted, I'm not reading a script right now, and in this video I'll try to explain what's been happening and what's next when it comes to making videos. Um, to be honest, 2022 has not been the best year of my life. It's, I'm not going to say it's been a horrible year, but it's not. It's been kind of bad this year, especially the last two months. I'm not going to give uh, too many details, of course. I'm not going to say names. I won't say names. But anyway, uh, in 2020, my parents divorced. I'm a 25-year-old guy with ASD who, at least for now, who at least for now. I've always lived with my parents until recently and because of a few reasons and also that divorced that, that, that divorce I just mentioned my dad no longer lives in the house he doesn't live in my house anymore at least uh, not always of course and the fact that he no longer lives in my house made me at least a little sad or depressed also if that wasn't enough, uh, just over a little over two weeks ago, I had an eye surgery, uh, an eye surgery for my right eye, an eye surgery for my right eye. I don't know how that condition is called in English right now, but yeah, I had an eye surgery and these past two weeks, it's been a little over two weeks since I had that eye surgery, I have not been able to do a lot. I've been listening to music, a lot of music, listening to a few music CDs for the first time actually, and that certainly didn't help. And speaking of things that didn't, that didn't help, I was interested in that game that was published by Curate a while ago, Massage Freaks. I'm interested in Massage Freaks a bit briefly. And there was a Nintendo Switch version announced. It was the first time I've been genuinely interested in a game published by Curiate. I wanted to play the Nintendo Switch version of Beat Rifle, what, Massage Freaks, whatever. And no, the Nintendo Switch version of Beat Rifle was probably cancelled. And now, if you want to play it, it's only on PC. It's available on Steam. But the Nintendo Switch version was probably cancelled, and that certainly did not help. It made me feel uh, even worse, because it's a game I was genuinely interested in. I love reading games, and I wanted to play the Switch version of Beat Rifle. And yeah, the divorce of my parents in 2020, but more than anything else, the fact that my father, my dad, no longer lives in the house, that eye surgery I had over two weeks ago, and the possible cancellation of the Switch version of Beat Rifle, those three things combined, yeah, these last two months have not been great. I've, have, I've been feeling a little sad or depressed, at least a little. I'm not going to say I feel awful, I don't want to live my life anymore, that would be going too far, but Sometimes I just don't feel like doing things I enjoy, playing video games, watching a movie, making videos. So that happened. I know I did not upload another video last month, this August, and that was because of the eye surgery I had for my right eye, a little of depression and blah, 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 blah. I know that right now you may not be hearing the best audio quality. To be honest, I mean, if I want to be even more honest right now, I'm using a rock band microphone right now. That it's, it feels a bit embarrassing to say that out loud, but yeah, right now I'm using a rock band microphone. I think I don't have much more things to say regarding the current situation. And so, what's next? Well, I might, I may might upload another video, at least another video, big video of course, uh, uh, more or less, this September, specifically another countdown, I have ideas, or maybe another The Many Voices of Ed's in Video Game video, I have a few ideas, uh, 
at least two or three voice actresses, I don't know if I pronounced that correctly, I still haven't made videos on. I made many videos of that series, uh, the many voices of Melissa Fan in video games, it was originally going to be the only one, the many voices of Erika Harlacher in video games, the many voices of Kelly Mintz in video games, etc. Those videos are very fun to make. I might make another one this September, but it's not something that will happen or I can say for sure. What I can say for sure is that this October I will upload the soundtrack of A Witch's Tale. Remember, remember that one? A Witch's Tale? That turn-based RPG developed by Hitmaker for Nintendo DS published many years ago? Yeah, that's not a maybe, maybe not. That will happen. I will upload the soundtrack of A Witch's Tale to YouTube. I know it's a bit redundant because for those two series, Awesome Video Game Music and Disturbing Video Game Music, I already uploaded Between Dream and Reality as one of those many videos for the ABGM series, Awesome Video Game Music, and I also uploaded Dark Tone as Disturbing Video Game Music number 28, I think. It's going to be a bit redundant because I'll upload those two themes again, but other than that, Regardless of the fact that it's going to be a little redundant because of those two teams, I'll upload the soundtrack of A Witch's Tale. That will happen, it's for certain. But other than that, I don't know. I can't say for sure what will happen next. What will happen is I'll upload the soundtrack of A Witch's Tale to YouTube. And I don't have more things to say. It feels kind of weird uh, just talking into these rock band microphone and not much else uh face reveal you don't need a face reveal uh it's been a long time since the last time i appeared on camera but if you want to see a recent picture of me there you go huh. i'm the hero of the wind um see you next time i guess uh, Kolonoa Fantasy Reverie series is great, I recommend it, but do not get the Nintendo Switch version, that's what I will say.